Hello champions, we're gonna have a look at a brand new character. It is Pete Dunn, the Bruiserweight. He is the free character this month for the event. Uh, we're gonna have a look at five star bronze as usual. Uh, I don't get to keep him. He was only sent to me to do this preview. So his coach ability at 7,000 is power rouse only. Reduce the strength of opponent's power gem by 50%. Now I'm gonna try, I'm gonna do this preview here at five star bronze. I'm gonna try to do a three star preview uh, later on when I get my own Pete done uh, and uh, use only basic trainers for that like I try to do every month. So stay tuned for that. Not guaranteed that I'm gonna be able to do it, but I'm gonna try to do it. Uh, other than that, this is gonna be a five star preview. So move set for that, green one, green three, and black two it is the moves a move set that is only possible at five star so it is the bitter end 11 mp green move finisher deals 66 000 damage and destroy eight random silence gems and pin the opponent the bite this is the five star move by the way eight mp green move deal 41.7k damage and choose four gems to make into silence gem and the German suplex, 8 MP black move, deals 32k damage and choose 4 green gems to destroy. Trainers for that, don't really need an MP trainer because right now there's perks on that basically gives you the MP that you're going to need. If that wasn't the case, definitely want to use an MP trainer here, probably bright so that you start with that uh, German suplex ready earlier. So we're gonna be using in this case Cesaro. So that move that destroy green gem will destroy five more green gems. This is for this move right there. You could be using also, uh, I believe it's Gallows, that black move that destroy more. Could be using that. Cesaro is gonna destroy five, so we're gonna be using that. A uh, move that generates silence gem will create five more. That comes from Shield Ambrose right there. And for coaches, we're going to be using NW Ogan to help with both colors and Gargano, uh, which I don't own, but was sent just for this preview as well. Don't get to keep it. I keep saying it, but people never remembers or actually don't pay attention, I guess. So Silence Gem do 15% more damage and uh, you generate one more Silence Gem. So again, I don't get to keep Gargano. <laughs> So let's do this. We're going to go versus AJ Styles. He's higher talent than I am. Uh, he does have a whole bunch of metals on, which are going to reduce the gem damage and everything. But the only guy that doesn't have any metals on on the road that I can face is Vader. And he's a powerhouse. So I'm a tech. So I would have damage over it. So i rather show against a stronger opponent than just beat the hell out of a weaker one. So kind of a better preview. At least that's what I think. So the bonuses that I do have on 15% more health, gem do 15% more damage. That's the feud bonus. All color moves start with two more move points. Take 10% less damage from all color move. 20% more health. All color moves start with three more MP and matching all color gem charge move of uh, that color by two more MP. So that's what we got on right now. And what I force you with uh, gem destroy move is that you generally, after using them the first time, you're generally out of uh, those colors to destroy the next time. Okay, so we don't have the green here, although we uh, we don't have the black, although we did have the green, so that's gonna work too. So we're gonna choose 10 to make into silence, but we only need one black. I'll only take one and I'll pick greens for the rest and take another here that way it's gonna start recycle that green
Like I said, we barely have any green left. I need four. I'm not going to take the other two because it's going to be more than I need and I don't want to basically uh, remove extra greens from the board because then when I have to do it all over again, I'm not going to have any greens on the board. So I want I want some to remain there, just taking what I need. All right. Now we're going to need the blacks. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. And, uh, well, let's take some green anyway. Oh, it was eight. I remember nine, so I picked one too many. I got lucky it didn't pick the green one. <laughs> Hopefully, he's going to do moves that is going to generate some green. Eh. Didn't get enough. I don't think that's going to be enough. Have more. Yeah, it's not, it's not enough. Uh, there's no point using it right away, because... Everything's going to move and uh, I likely I'm going to lose some and I'm still missing three right there. Uh, well, let's take away his purple, I guess. Well, one of his purple. Not gonna get the extra turn after all. <laughs> right, let's pick eight black. I probably don't need eight. With him having medals and me not having any, it really, it really basically put much of a, much of a hinder on this because we're definitely not on the same power level. Next turn, this is taking forever. He soaks so much damage. Takes away half the damage I do with his medals, so. I'm gonna try to go for all my biggest gems right there. 
I'm not gonna be able to reload it anyway. I'm only gonna destroy eight, so I'm gonna only pick eight. This should be enough to get the win. Yeah, definitely. It's the base damage is more than what he has left. This works. Definitely very board dependent. This didn't go well whatsoever. Uh, but I would expect it's definitely not a spec that it's gonna go well every time. I mean, it's probably more likely not gonna go well than go well. So this is probably a good representation on how it's gonna go. Uh, obviously, it could be a different story if he were facing someone that wasn't soaking half the damage I'm doing uh, from his medals. That probably would have been a much shorter match if that was the case. But still, overall, not too bad. So let's have a look at something else. All right, second move set. Small variation of the first one we saw. It's going to be using the green two instead of the green one. Uh, still using the green three, which means this is a five star move set. It is the vintage nine MP green move. Deal 47k damage and make four random science gems into blast gem. The bite eight MP green move deals 41.7k damage and choose four gems to make into silence gem. And the German suplex eight MP black move deals 32k damage and choose four green gems to destroy. Trainers will be using Cesaro to destroy more green, Bray to start with that German suplex ready. Uh, and we're going to have Ray and Gargano, respectively, to make one more Blast and Silence Gem. And have those do an extra 15% uh, and 25% for Ray. Uh, this is basically going to be using that black to get the green we need to get both of those ready. Then we make the five Silence Gem we need. We turn them into Blast, break them, try to get that either... A lot of green or a lot of black in there so that we can recycle those moves unfortunately we're gonna have to go versus vader which is gonna give us class advantage since he's a power house the reason i'm going with versus him is that he's the only opponent on the road that doesn't have any medals on and i tried four times to do a match versus an opponent that has metal i can't even win the match so unfortunately while his work move set works, it requires a pretty specific board to get your colors. And if your opponent soaks up half of the damage you're doing because he has medals and you don't, well, that makes this almost impossible. <laughs> so if you're facing someone with medals, you're gonna you're gonna need some yourself. it would be a different story if it wasn't destroy moves and would be like a choose move or even a random for that matter but yeah since it's destroy moves that means you're relying on the board having those colors if the board has those colors you're good but if it doesn't you're in for trouble <laughs> all right so right now we need three black that uh, tree uh, green uh, i don't want to overdo it because i don't want to risk my turn ending and also i do want them to remain on the board so we're only gonna take what we need okay well i rather have the extra Blacks right there. It's not going to be enough to fill the black. It's not going to be enough to fill the green. Actually, it was enough to fill the green. Again.
Um, actually, not take this. I will take this. Missing one. And this is gonna end the match. This went really well, especially considering I just tried a bunch of time versus someone with metals. So, I mean, he's, he's, all his damage is gem based. So, if you face someone that soaks up all the damage with their metals, it's gonna be a problem. Obviously, keep in mind, like I said, we did have class advantage for this fight, so that does make quite a difference as well would be great if i could face another five star that is another class without medals right, let's look at something else all right different move set uh, this time it's going to be the black two along with boat blues it is the german suplex 8 mp black move Deal 32k damage and choose 4 green gems to destroy. The pedigree, 7 MP blue move, deal 29.4k damage and choose 7 green gems to modify into multiplied gems of strength 4. And the x -plex, 6 MP blue move, deal 16.8k damage and swap a 5x1 random maria into black gems. Trainers will be using for that Cesaro to destroy more of those uh, green because we're going to be making seven. Obviously, nine is overkill, but doing four was not enough. So Cesaro is going to be useful for that. We're going to be using Matt Hardy, so that multiplier is going to be six instead of four. Don't really need an MP trainer here because the moves are fairly cheap, especially right now with the perks. But anyway... Uh, the way that I have the coaches here, we're going to have NWO Ogan to get one of any MP we match. And we're going to have Andre to get an extra blue. That means if I match three blue, I'm going to get five. So, and with the perk, I'm actually going to get seven. So, <laughs> didn't really need them, but it's still going to show. We're going to, we're going to go versus Vader here. Uh, main reason for that again is because he just doesn't have the firepower to take on metals. Just keep in mind that we do have class advantage over him. Right. So we're gonna pick a five by one area. Turn into black. Actually, we don't pick, it's random. We're not going to use it right away because I'm missing one MP right there. Let's just get that. Alright, so. We're going to choose seven... Green, actually, yes. One, two, six, seven. And now we're going to choose to destroy them. I can destroy all of them anyway, because I don't need the green other than to do this. 
Now those were 48k in each. He's not getting out of that. This was pretty effective. Better than I thought. Now obviously we add the class advantage here. But that worked out better than I thought it would. Let's look at something else. Alright, so this went pretty damn well versus Vader. So I'm actually curious to see how it's going to go versus a guy that has a ton of medals on. So we're going to try this versus Piper, which does have first a lot of health and second a lot of medals. So I'm curious. Kicking out should not be a problem since he has all those medals. My pins are not going to be that big. Uh, so yeah, let's see. I'm, I'm curious how it's going to go versus someone that's all medaled up when I'm not. Let's use this. Like a five by one area. It's gonna fill my black. And end my turn. <laughs> okay, now we're gonna pick seven greens. Turn into multiplies. You add exactly seven. Well, those are going to do 24.8k each. I'll have more than that destroy. Oh. He soaked up 100k of that. Okay, we're out. Hit the blue. Load it up, both blue move. Let's get out of that. Okay. The black. Fact. Choose seven green. Let's try nine. No cascade whatsoever. Again, he soaked up 110,000 out of that. You have blue. Refilled everything. Hopefully not get rid of any of the little 
five greens I have. Fortunately, didn't get more greens. Guess this will have to do. Taking forever. One. Burn all my blue. use this move only two green unfortunately but it will refill the blue automatically I mean, we got the win that definitely worked but yeah those medals like i can definitely need, see that he's gonna need medals to face other guys with medals because just doesn't have the fire power otherwise all right let's look at something completely different All right, so I had to look at the rest of his move and I can't really see any other move set that would make sense. So that's pretty much it for done. Uh, pretty much in line with what you would expect out of a free character. Uh, nowhere near uh, what Carmella was because she was clearly way too good to be a free character. Uh, he does pretty well versus someone that doesn't have any medals. Uh, not so much versus someone that does have medals. It might be a different story if he did have medals himself though, but I didn't have any to equip on him. So I uh, couldn't try that. So yeah, probably a mid-range guy. I mean, again, pretty much what you'd expect out of a free character. So thanks for watching guys. If you're not already a sub, make sure to do so to be kept aware when I post new stuff. If you have any questions, ask them. And if you like the video, leave a like and share. See you guys. Gia. Ciao.